I always knew that Mexicans were here working. But now, <laughs> everywhere I go, and I'm a truck driver, everywhere I go, the warehouses are full of Mexicans. And I get it when Donald Trump said that they are coming here taking all the black jobs. That was not a racist comment. And black people, y'all so tender when it comes to what our counterparts say to us that when they say it, we get upset. And we only get upset is because it's true. These are the black jobs. These are the jobs that convicted felons have that can't work in the corporate world. The jobs like truck driver, electrician, plumbing, these trade jobs, these trade jobs, construction worker, these trade jobs are our jobs. Let's face the fact. But as a truck driver, when I tell you, I don't even know. And I'm I'm in, I'm here in Chicago. And oh my God, it's so infested with Mexicans. And and I don't have a problem with Mexicans. I have a problem with Mexicans that are here illegally, that aren't registered, that are receiving assistance. And we have been here this whole time and we are still pulling up by our bootstraps. We are still struggling out here and they coming in and I'm watching right now. I'm getting loaded up, unloaded right now here in Chicago and they are happy. I'm talking about laughing and working hard because they know the opportunity is a fresh opportunity from them for them. It's like being born again, them being able to come here to America and get all of this free assistance, take all the jobs like readily available, low uh, cost labor, like just everything that we as a country work so hard to build and we are allowing illegals to come in here and just wipe out all the jobs. I'm not okay with that at all. And if we're going to let the Democrat heads get in office and continue to destroy our country, then y'all are voting for the wrong reason. I don't agree with everything Trump say, but I damn sure don't agree with nothing that the de Democrats are trying to uh, mandate or uh, their agenda. None of that. All I do know is that Trump, he is not a politician. He's a businessman. He has money. And Trump, he has he has an ego that says that I cannot lose. I will not fail. So his position as a president, he has to win. He hates failure. Yes, he has taken losses. Who hasn't? But I know that's a man that wants to come back in here and do for America because he want to he wants to go down in in history as the best president. So I know where his mindset is. It's not, oh, I just want to be president because he's he didn't take a salary as a president in 2016 to 2020. So you got to ask yourself, what is his motive and he's already a billionaire. He's rich. He has money. He's going to always have money. 
but I know that he has to lead the American people and he wants to create jobs. He wants to keep jobs over here. He wants to take care of, of America first. And that's what I understand. That's what I'm hearing. I don't hear what other voters hear that are against him. I have voted Democrat. I voted Democrat for the first time when Obama was in the office. And when he showed me how he flipped the script and was not for the people of America and he had his own agenda and how he was quickly to sign bills for the LGBTQ AI community and you know going to war and all that stuff that was he was one of the worst presidents Donald Trump is the president for 2020 for and I am rolling with him and those who are not rolling with him fuck you peace